Well, here comes one of my next projects. I don't need it, but this came with the lathe. You can see that the angles there are wrong. It's not riding right here, and it's crooked. The center has to move over at least a half inch, and we're damn near an inch low. So my first move is to cut it off right here, separate the bottom, primarily because I have to shorten it more than what I can get here. And once I get it separated, I'm gonna cut this to the proper angle up to approximately somewhere around here. This thing's plenty strong. It's it's very thick on the back side, so there's no chance of weakening it. And then I'll level the whole thing so it sits level and square. Just by doing this here, I should be able to gain probably close to a quarter inch offset that way. Then, after I cut up to about here, cross on both sides, I'll plane this flat and cut this and then I can get my center left to right and my up and down this is sorry about that this is the original jaw for it and uh well i don't think it's original i don't think any of it's original I shouldn't say that anyways it's too long even when it's set in there right Usually goes right in. Even when it's set in there right, you can see it's long. I'm probably going to shorten this end. And then I'm going to drill a hole right there. And I'm going to mount a couple of 10 millimeter roller bearings. One on each side. On all three. It's already got, you can see that it's way too proud of the circle. So once I cut it down, I'll be able to take them bearings out if I want to. I'll just put them in with Allen screws. But then I can get it shortened down so I can use the, pretty much the entire circle. It's completely useless as is, so... Even if I wad it up and end up in the iron barrel, it's uh, got about the same use right now. So that's the plan. I don't know when I'm going to start it pretty soon. I tried every machine that I have, the shaper. My saw won't cut this. There's no way to hold it. No fixture plate. Um... The jaws are too short and they're swivel jaws so that there's just not there's just no way to cut it on the power saw. Because of all this rigmarole here, I can't cut it on the shaper. I could take the vise off and fixture plate it on the shaper, but <laughs> that vise weighs about 500 pounds. I ain't playing with that. What I can do I already had it on there. I can grip it right here, side laying on its side in the mill. I got a four inch long, three eighths uh, bit for the mill that's never been used. So I'll chop it down as far as I can with sheep end mills, and I'll use my 
extra long high quality one to finish it with but that's a project <laughs>